I got a black backpack and a gun. Gunman inside uh, King Supers. Accident, hit and run, the vehicle's on fire. Missing person, we got two officers that are gonna be on scene. Colorado, unpredictable weather. It's not looking too good. We found the lake that's on the highway. It could be anywhere from a foot to two feet. That's insane. <laughs> and females apparently jumped the fence and are under the bridge. Forward to Edward, I can divert to that if you'd like. We're going to a suspicious occurrence. Three males and one female underneath the bridge. Let's go see if we can find some people. Forward to Edward, uh, 42 Frank, I'm coming up behind you guys. All the stuff you need to cook your meth on, your heroin on, and then there's all the syringe caps. You guys are brave living here. Are you saying they hop right there? They're probably at the other end. I'll take a peek. They're not in there now. Nah, they're gone. What was that? Ooh, lightning? Yeah, I need to go. Once again, Colorado. Unpredictable weather. It's not looking too good. <laughs> a lot of lightning strikes. Wow. Wow. <laughs> this is crazy. I've never seen this much rain. Thank God we're a mile high. <laughs> I've lived in Colorado pretty much my entire life. That's insane. I've never witnessed wow the rain like this before. <laughs> I gotta look and see how fast this is actually coming down. This is unreal. So we'll get a lot of cars like that that'll go real fast and they don't see that puddle of water right there. Boom, right there. This is bad. We're missing a lane of traffic. And about to be two lanes. The westbound lanes is fine. Eastbound, not so much. No way. We found the lake that's on the highway. It could be anywhere from a foot to two feet. It's flooded pretty bad. What we're gonna do is just go back to the top and block the ramp off. Best thing to do is make a U-turn. So cars do not come down here and stall their vehicle. Oh, good. She's turning around. It's about four feet of water. It's just half full. I'm blocking it. 25. It's just heavily flooded. But they said there was a small car floating in it. Dang. This is not a good idea. If the weather is too bad, you know, to drive on the road, it's best just to stay inside. I know we might have to get somewhere, but your safety is paramount. 1725 Sheridan Boulevard at the King Supers on a help call. Male in a black hoodie, black satchel, currently armed with a handgun, still inside the store. 42 Edward going that way. So right now we got a call of a uh, gunman inside uh, King Supers. We're looking for a black male. He went inside and robbed the King Supers and then left on foot. I think they think they're still back behind the King Supers. King Supers? So. Right now we're setting up a perimeter, then we'll see what's going on. Just on the north end of King Supers, I got a black backpack and a gun stashed behind a dumpster. Didn't find him. Who knows where he could have gone by that time we all got on scene. I think he probably went west and went north through the neighborhoods. District 1, it's Commander Pazin's, one of his uh, big things is uh, crime prevention. You know, if we can stop little things right now, it'll not lead into bigger things. Because most criminals, they start out real small. The next time they get a little bolder, take a weapon with them. So if we can stop those individuals from doing things like that through uh, crime prevention, then it's, uh, it's a good day for us. 40 Edward, clear. 